Thank you once again for joining my channel. And with all the talk about soft mounting motors, I thought I would put my two cents into it. Um, the other day I had, um, well, you may have seen the video where I had uh, hit hit uh, hit the concrete during a crash. Well, I noticed the ends of my motor mounts, uh, ends of my motor, uh, my frame, um, getting messed up and, you know, where you hit the concrete, obviously. So, um, I was also seeing some of these videos about soft mounting your, um, your motors. Um, I've always soft mounted my flight controller. So, um, and I did notice a big difference when I did that the first time. So, I thought, well, shoot, I'd give the, um, uh, the soft mount and the motors uh, the same chance. So, um, I was thinking about putting some motor guards on here. So, I got to looking on uh, Thingverse and I found these right here for your motors, motor mounts, uh, for you know, motor, motor protectors is what they call them. So, I thought, well, um, since I had just started uh, printing in TPU, which is flexible, why not take these motor protectors and turn them upside down and put your motors on top here. So let's do that and let's see what it looks like. Um, of course, i um, not going to be able to test out uh, if I see any differences between the two. Um, and so, but anyways, hey, uh, you may need it. If you don't need it, if you don't got it, you might notice it. If you don't need it and you have it, well, you got it, and well, I guess there's no question. So normally, here's your motor right here, and you would just uh, most people are taking these and mounting them like so. So either way, your screw's still going through it. So why not just take the TPU printed one, turn it around. And then I'll, I can kill two birds with one stone, and I'm able to re re protect my motors a little better on my arms. And then I'm also able to get the um, uh, the dampening uh, for the motor vibration. So um, I did end up having to go from six millimeter screws to um, eight millimeter screws. So this. I'll make sure we get the right ones in there. It's obviously uh, just don't want to be shorting out any motors. And I'll probably go back through and uh, lock tight these because, well, I'm a I'm one of the guys that lock tight their motors. Rather, better be safe than sorry, right? Alright, so it's just as easy as that. No dealing with tape, which people have been using. No dealing with little rubber uh, rubber tubing people are saying that they're using. Um, no putting holes in it. All the holes are already there. It's printed out. Uh, TPU's got a little flex in it. Um, so, um, I also will be protecting my motors and protecting my arms. So, there you go. That was just my two cents in... Uh, about the soft mounting uh, your motors just kill two birds with one stone thank you for viewing my video have a wonderful day